Hello from the gateway to the Jurassic Coast. We're at the Vitality Stadium in Bournemouth. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Bournemouth up against West Ham United. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. And the starting 11 for Bournemouth. Well, I think they have a nice balance to their team. A solid back four, two holding midfielders, three creative players in advance of them, and a mobile centre forward. It's a good team. And the starting lineup for West Ham United. The experienced Lukasz Fabianski stands between the posts. Kurt Zuma plays with Angelo Ogbonna in central defence. Tomas Socek starts alongside Declan Rice in central midfield. And the striker today is Mikel Antonio. Thank you, Vitality Stadium. Enjoy the game. And the contest begins. And a tidy challenge. Oh, they've lost it. Solanke moving it forward but they took care of the situation defensively Lucas Paqueta so well to deny him going short sloppy in possession from West Ham and this might not be the ideal situation for them and the shot just over the top. Effective challenge. Tomas Socek. And West Ham in a position of menace. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Teammates available. Billing. Very quick thinking there. Tomasz Socek. The Hammers come away with it. Joe Rothwell. Now with Lerma. Perfect tackle. In with a chance. Can he find the net? Couldn't beat the keeper, unfortunately for him. Well, I think that's a bad miss. He just never looked convincing as he went through there. Oh, 
Jefferson Lerma. And unable to keep the ball. Well, the referee wasn't going to let that go. Well, some referees might have elected to hand out the yellow card, but no booking on this occasion. not how they rehearsed it on the training ground. Yeah, and I'm not sure what was going through his mind there. That was a poor decision to shoot from that distance. They've got it now, what can they do? Rice? Well, it could be on for him here. And a goal to give them the lead. They have their reward. Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. So underway again here, one nil the score. Nicely timed tackle. And Bournemouth have it back now. He's showing a real will to win the ball. Can he find the right pass? Antonio, he's in with a chance. Well, he was on his own. He had the goalkeeper to beat, but failed to do so. Well, he just needed to show a bit more composure there. Take a little bit off the shot, I think. West Ham unable to hold on to the ball. Lama. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Oh, is he going to be punished here? And with that, they've thwarted the opportunity. And the flag does go up, must have been tight. Well timed tackle. Chris Meppen. They couldn't keep it. Now, do they mean business on this occasion? Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Lucas Paqueta. And we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here.
Paqueta. The save was a good one. And the referee blows the whistle. The first half is in the history books here at the Vitality. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the play. And now they get the ball rolling. Into the second half then, West Ham with the advantage, but certainly no room for complacency. Well, clearly in the mood to make it a double, but fine goalkeeping. Well, he's playing really well today. That was another decent attempt. They will now make use of their substitutes bench. Played over. Paqueta. And up for grabs off the keeper. And a time for calm on the ball. And given away. Paqueta. And very deftly cut out. And successfully cut out. And well, they know they need to stop him. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Could be a chance to break here. Well, advantage with them. Referee says play on. Possession lost. Possession lost by West Ham. Solanke, well able to close down the short. Not the easiest of situations for the keeper. Well, the crowd are doing their bit. Can they find the equaliser here? They favoured a short one here. The chance is on. And a goal, the equaliser. Superb entertainment. Well, here it is again, and what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack it, but you do have to ask questions of the keeper. Could he have done better here? I think so. You can't be beaten at your near post like that. So back underway, they've levelled it at 1-1 here. <laughs> Running with the ball confidently. Well, the supporters think it's on. They've only gone and grabbed another one. Two goals in quick succession. Now they have the lead. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. But there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep him at bay and finishes with a plum. It's a great goal. Let's 
So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the scoreline. Solanke. Oh, big chance. And the keeper there to deal with it. And taken short. Well, pressure building. Another corner. And how about the short corner? Determined defending. Has a go. Well, difficult angle, good try. Well, he took a chance there, and you have to say that was a great effort from that position. And the substitution will occur now. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. A very good tackle. Into the final 20 minutes. Declan Rice. Well, time just challenged magnificently. Can he find the right pass? No let up in the pressing department. And he did well to cut it out. Getting forward. Well, it's been a good last 15 minutes for Bournemouth. They're having most of the ball now, and they certainly deserve their Oh, lead. wait a minute. They could be in here. Oh, offside. How marginal was that? But the flag is raised. of challenge put in so check Paqueta very quick thinking there now who can he play it to Ten minutes to go then. How can they turn one of these attacks into a goal? Takes it on! The save was a good one. Well, a corner it is, and they know they've got to be opportunistic at this stage of the game. A short one here. Well, another corner kick conceded. Let's see what they do this time. Now sending it in. He did his job defensively. Rice. A bit sloppy in possession. Oh, that goes down as a wonderful save. But now we see that the offside flag has gone up. Well, just listen to this atmosphere. It's been such a tight game, but the fans are certainly doing their bit in trying to get them over the finish line. 
Rice. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Good pressure high up the pitch. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. So a personnel change then. Nayef Aguer making progress Jared Bowen can he convert and a goal to level the top late on here just look at the reaction Well, here it is again. It was a good finish, but the keeper has to do better at his near post. He was beaten far too easily on that occasion. West Ham so back underway, dead level, 2-2. And a timely intervention. Decent progress with the ball at his feet. And in with a real chance. Oh, they've done it! They forged ahead, and it might be the goal that gives them victory. Well, as you can see, this was always coming. They've been piling on the pressure. It's a well-deserved goal. And the ball is moving again. 3-2. And there it is, the final whistle. A frustrating experience for Bournemouth and their fans around the world. A defeat here. Stuart, how would you sum it up? Well, Derek, not quite good enough today. Yes, they only lost by one goal, but I never felt they were in control of the game. A frustrating day all round for the coach to think about for the next time. Well, we're highlighting him for a reason, Stuart. He's put in a really authoritative performance here. Well, I thought he had a good all-round performance today, only emphasised by the late winner. An extremely important moment, and boy, did he deliver. And this might not be the ideal situation. And the shot just over the top. Can he find the net? Couldn't beat the keeper, unfortunately for him. Well, I think that's a bad miss. He just never looked convincing as he went through there. Rice. Well, it could be on for him here. to give them the lead they have their reward Antonio he's in with a chance well he was on his own he had the goalkeeper to beat but failed to do so well he just needed to show a bit more composure there
Well, clearly in the mood to make it a double, but fine goalkeeping. Well, he's playing really well today. That was another decent... Not the easiest of situations for the keeper. Well, the crowd are doing their bit. Can they find the equaliser? And a goal, the equaliser. Superb entertainment. Running with the ball confidently. They've only gone and grabbed another one. Two goals in quick succession. Now they have the lead. No. Oh, big chance. And the keeper there to deal with it. Determined defending. Has a go. Well, difficult angle, good try. Well, he took a chance there, and you have to say that was a great effort from that position. Now can they turn one of these attacks into a goal? Takes it on! The save was a good one. Well, a corner it is, and they know they've got to be opportunistic at this stage of the game. convert and a goal to level it up late on here just look at the reaction and in with a real chance 